Welcome to CES 2019, where we're presenting Molex's advanced in-vehicle network architecture. Um, this architecture is for the full in-vehicle connectivity end-to-end -end and uh, supports autonomous vehicles as well. This year, we're really excited to be here with several new collaborators, um, working with AWS and Accenture to integrate voice assistant and some machine learning and AI capabilities into the vehicle platform. Also working with Laird CVS, which is a new uh, addition to Molex. Excited to add their antenna technology to our in-vehicle network platform to really uh, engage a, a full vehicle connectivity solution, both, both inside and outside of the vehicle. One of our customers, you know, mentioned this to me, uh, you know, a couple weeks ago where we walked in and we're talking about all this technology and he kind of said, well, where have you guys been? You know, we had no idea that you do this. And we said, well, the reason is, is that just today in vehicles, you're now starting to get high-speed networks. And that's Molex's sweet spot. What Connected Mobility has is each step forward with autonomous features, whether it's more functional safety opportunities, or there's, less, uh, there's more autopilot, uh, we're going to continue to grow with electronics that are driving that. But it's not just more cables and more connectors. Our integration of the software and the security requirements uh, that integrate the hardware and the software is a big focus for us when we look at autonomous opportunities. The Molex solution, what we call our multi-zone architecture, enables the OEMs to optimize not only the wiring within the vehicle, the end-to-end -end wiring, but also optimize the bandwidth uh, requirements within the vehicle and thereby optimize the cost of their final solutions. When a gateway fails within the vehicle, for instance, we'll give an example. The, the front right gateway is controlling the steering module. If that gateway fails, that control operation is moved to the left gateway. And the left gateway is also communicating to that device with CAN. So there's a seamless failover when it happens. Every year a better booth display and every year better solutions as we continue to engage and work with our customers, we can continue to learn what their real pain points are and we work to solve those and bring some of those solutions back as well as some of our advanced thinking, uh, trying to think of their pain points not just next year but in five years down the line and try to show them that as well and that's been a lot of fun.